Hi, this is Todd Kelting. This is another episode of the video version of Tuesdays with Todd. Today we are putting the pieces together, dealing with what actually has to happen in order to get the eviction scheduled. In some counties in Maryland, um, Prince George's County, uh, landlords are able to actually pre-schedule their evictions throughout the year. So if you're a company with a large enough footprint in Prince George's County, you should call the sheriff's office if you haven't already done so and try to get your eviction scheduled. Having a set eviction date is obviously beneficial because it gives you days each month where you can have evictions take place. In other counties, sometimes you're at the mercy of the sheriff if and when they get to you in terms of when an eviction gets scheduled. Sheriff's office technically has 60 days from the date that the writ is issued to carry out the eviction, but the sheriff's offices oftentimes are a little more flexible with that since the delays are always their fault. Um, in some jurisdictions, the burden is on you to actually contact the sheriff to get the eviction scheduled. That's in places like Montgomery County or in Baltimore City where you actually have to affirmatively reach out, reach out to the sheriff's office to get the eviction scheduled. The sheriff will tell you what size crew you need to have on the date of the eviction, whether you need to have a locksmith or not, and what time and date the eviction will take place. In Baltimore City, the landlord has an affirmative obligation to send out two separate notices before the eviction can occur. One gets sent by mail, you have to go to the post office and get a certificate of mailing. Sounds very uh, 19th century, but that's how it's done. And there's a second notice that has to get actually posted to the tenant's door before the eviction takes place. In other jurisdictions, the sheriff will carry out the eviction on the date that it's scheduled, but it's really important to make sure that you have the crew there because if the crew's not there, the sheriff will not carry out an eviction and you'll have to wait until your next date. That's this week's episode, Tuesdays with Todd.